afternoon everybody Asante ni nyote leo ilikuwa tupate wanaazimio wote we meet and greet we appreciate ourselves for a, a very good campaign a four month campaign versus a four year or was it a nine year campaign well done. You're nothing short of heroes. In those four months, you transformed the terrain and you painted Kenya blue. We have taken the first step in transforming Kenya. We have much more to do. And therefore, today is just telling ourselves you may be feeling the fatigue of the last four months because we were not sleeping, we were Live, living and sleeping and dreaming just the campaign. It is exhausting, but let your mind recharge because we've got more work to do. And for all of you, because you are in Nairobi, we need to distribute ourselves to the various places where our strength is needed to guard our win because we have won. I was looking at the list of members of parliament. I almost am very tempted to read out the names. I will not, <laughs> I may not tire you because they've been introduced, but we are just short of 180 when you combine. You see? We have 24 governors at the moment. If you add Mombasa and Kakamega, which, whose by-election is coming later, you will see that we have strength around the country. If you look at our competition, they are just at about 130 members of parliament. When I last counted, even if it improves, it will not come anywhere near what we have. So even without anybody telling you the numbers, with those numbers of members of parliament, of governors, of senators, senators we have 23, they, ha they are one up. But if you look at everything, including um, all the other seats combined, there is no way, no way, the tally can be against us. And by the way, we have tallied. It's just that we do not have the power to announce ourselves. Because the forms have been, were on the portal. And we took copies and we tallied. And we know where we are. And we know if we had the power, by now, we would have called it for ourselves. But we will wait. We will wait for that announcement. But please be upbeat, know that Kenyans did give us the opportunity to steer the nation, and we are waiting for the official seal of approval. Our coalition is Azimio Laumoja. That work of unifying Kenyans, you saw the map there. We've taken a step, but that's just the beginning. We have a lot of work to do. We have a lot of work to ensure that the people we serve get the benefits of the taxes that they pay. And those benefits are not distributed by a few to their pockets. So we really have a lot of work to do. We have a lot of work to do to build the spirit 
of one people, one nation. So that we first and foremost consider ourselves Kenyan and then our communities and the rest. Because it's not wrong to acknowledge our diversity, to acknowledge the various uh, communities we are coming from. That's our heritage, we are proud of it, but we must always emphasize our oneness as a nation. And that is what we represent as Azimio. And that is why even during the campaign, we promised to look after everyone, including those opposed to what we stand for. Recognizing that they are Kenyans, we said we shall look after everybody, and we meant it. And uh, like we used to say, you know our captain, we are here with his blessings, with his knowledge, he sends his greetings. You know our captain is a man who has a very generous heart. He never carries forward grudges. He's a person who embraces all and a person who focuses his energies on what is good for the nation. We really are looking forward to this election being called for us so that we can support him to deliver to the nation, as I know he will. <laughs> Knowing that we have a lot of reform work to do, and we would have wanted more reforms even before the elections, we have to very jealously guard even that process that is ongoing at BOMAS. I know some of you have been there, Thank you so much for your presence. Those who have not been there, let us all try to take turns. We need to support that process to ensure that it is not infiltrated, to ensure that it is not corrupted. That is the purpose of having agents in the Tallinn Center, to ensure that the numbers are put together the way they should be and that the authentic forms count, all the authentic forms count, not any other form by the wayside, so that we can get to the conclusion of this. But I cannot tell you how pleased I am to see all the faces around, and I want to echo something Kioni and Kanini have said, and I think also uh, my good friend, His Excellency, the Governor-elect of CIA, that for those from Mount Kenya region, because except Meru, no seats have been won in that area. But you actually won votes, and actually Meru and Nyandarwa. Yes, sorry, I apologize for Nyandarwa because there is Kiaraho. And uh, yes, there are two from Nyandarwa. Even where no seat came, votes still came. And if, they may not have been as many as we hoped, but you can imagine, if those votes had gone the way, some chest-thumping fellows were announcing they would go, then it would have been called out for them the first day. But because it was not, because we disrupted that chesting thumping, chest thumping uh, boast and made it idle. We are now waiting for it to be called for us. When you go to war, even in the areas where we got as many votes, the occasional person who missed, you're still our hero because you put up a fight and you stood in the gap. So for those who are here and you didn't make it, feel greatly appreciated. You are part of us, and together we are going to take the next steps and to build a formidable coalition, to build a formidable nation, and to build a movement that will transform our landscape and to ensure always that our nation is peaceful. I want to thank you for coming at very short notice. I think you started receiving calls yesterday. Some of you had, have had to travel 
some overnight. We want to thank you. And this is the same spirit we saw during the campaigns. We would give you very little notice when coming to your areas. You never disappointed. You mobilized. You were there. And you have made it what it is today. You are our heroes, each one of you. We thank you. We love you. And we want you to know that we look forward to working with all of you as one. We do not uh, view any part of the country as not part of the blue nation. Where we need several more coats of blue, we have enough paint in our stores. We are, go we are coming. Where you have an undercoat that does not proclaim the blue nation, we want to tell you that you belong to us too. We will convince you it will not be a force taking, but we are coming because Kenya must be one. And that doesn't mean there should be no dissent. We appreciate and recognize the right of everybody to dissent. But that spirit of oneness, because that is what Azimio Laomoja represents, oneness. That spirit of oneness, that nationhood, is what we are going to spread to the whole country while respecting differences in opinion. I don't want to go any further, just to say we are ready for the task ahead. This is just the beginning of our meetings. This was a meet and greet. Immediately, the announcement we expect is made. There will be many more meetings. You will meet as members of parliament, as National Assembly, as Senate, to caucus and elect leadership. Women reps will also meet, because they also need to um, caucus around themselves. And those governors will meet. We intend to showcase devolution. You know, our captain is very passionate about devolution. Indeed, I would christen him the father of devolution. This is our chance to make devolution what it should be. So we look forward to governors caucusing, sharing, encouraging one another, and sharing good practices on what to do to make devolution work for Kenya. So like I've said, this is just one of the first of the many meetings we are going to have. I want once again to urge you if there are places they have not finished tallying for members of parliament, any place they have not issued certificates, go support our members. At BOMAS, let us take turns. Let us support that process. We have invested. We have our votes there. We have our win being tallied. So go out there and let us ensure everything goes on well. I want to thank you. Once again, congratulate you all, not just those who got the seats, all those who put their best foot forward to make today what it is. And we look forward to working together and making it happen for Kenya. Asante.